Well lads, what's the crack? My name is Orgy the Runner and welcome back to Life is Strange 2. So, we've set up camp here. I just skipped one cutscene uh, because I thought it was just best to get that one out of the way without uh, dragging it out, if that makes any sense. But just a quick recap from the first episode, or from the first part I should say. Uh, basically, our dad got killed because of an altercation we had with a neighbour and a policeman. And so we're on, on the run because we shoved our neighbor he fell down awkwardly on a rock not sure if he hit his head or his back or, or whatever but either way upon seeing his dad get killed that his uh daniel he unleashed his powers that he didn't know he had and he still doesn't know he, he has them and on top of which he still is isn't privy to what's going on he doesn't know what happened to his dad because it's all a blank so we're going to have to explain that at some point but either way let's get right back into the meat of the game so yeah we set up our little camp here skip the little cutscene so right now we have to find logs and there's logs of plenty here here's one now this is perfect my feet hurt oh my ass hurts from exercises and what I wasn't doing butt things or anything dirty, I swear to god. Nice and dry. Oh, already make it sexual. <laughs> hmm. That's enough for a toasty fire. Yeah, that's one thing I've, I've never been or that's one thing I've never done. I've never been on camping Where myself before. Well, too bad, Daniel. I, I already have three here. And here we go. Hey Daniel! You can stop. Why? We got enough for tonight, man. Mm. You're cheating. You're bigger than me. <sighs> Who cares? <laughs> now we got some time to explore before we light up the fire. Cool. Oh, good idea. I'll go check the river. Cool, Daniel. You just get me fish. Nice fresh ones. Yeah, Thank you. I like this kid. He's on the ball. He, he's smart. He's handsome. Well, that's what he said, said. And, of course, he's got an eye for Minecraft things. Shit, those are bear claws. Uh-oh. Hopefully mm -hmm. we won't find Gotta any bears. Daniel. Ah, Daniel is a man of the wild. He knows how to take care of these things. Gotcha. Mm, no, I don't. Oh. Here, give me that, you rookie. What are you doing, mountain boy? I'm gonna catch a fish to cook. Nice. But we should wait until we get some gear or something. I can do it. Just watch. I know. We'll come back later. Okay. Where are we going now? You promise? Promise. Yeah, sure, why not? Oh, wait, sit and draw. Oh, it's going to open up a bit of an inner monologue Feels kind good of thing. to focus on something after all that shit. I should take a good look at the subject before drawing. Okay, move with or Oh! This is nice. This is very nice. Focus. Cool. I think I'm ready to draw this. Wait, move to draw. Oh, that's not bad. Shoot, he... Oh, sorry, Mr. Fish. I need to train my visual memory. Focus. A little more. Time to take the pen, dude. Hmm, not like that. Dad gave me the sketchbook. He was so fucking awesome. Hmm. Pretty good. But I can add more details if I want. I don't get it. It won't skip. <sighs> okay. Got it. Okay. Just to add the finishing few touches here. Oh, that's nicer a real Picasso. Or Michelangelo. I didn't memorize what I'm drawing. I need to take a look. 
Okay, then, Josh, I'm trying to concentrate I've here on my enough. sweet summer child. Time to draw now. This almost looks like a peaceful memory. Almost. Oh, achievement unlocked, yeah. Sketchy. Nice. I almost wish I was playing this on the PS4, but the PS4 is locked to 30 FPS, and to be honest, if a game isn't in 60 FPS, it's kind of a, a bit of a letdown for me. I will not say it's a no-go, but my eyes are so used to seeing everything in, well, most games in 60 FPS. Not saying that uh, 60 FPS makes a game, but... Uh, does add a bit of a wow factor. All right, bro, what you doing? Will you stop attacking nature? Ooh, Try to save the trees, not kill done. them. Yeah, I'll play his opponent. You, you can try and attack Bond me. Guard, Sir Daniel. But I'm fighting the tree, not you. The light. <laughs> we'll purge you. Uh, not fun, Sean. You know you're bigger than me. Not fair. Yeah, and you're more lovely, livelier than a uh, freaking tree. I've had enough nature for one day. <laughs> oh, did I bully him? Here, come here, squirt. Let me bully you some more. Where are you going? Where are you going? Where the frick are you going? You're going off in a sulk? Going sulking? Alright, go into your sulking corner, you big bubble boing baby. Okay, now sit over there, sit down, and shut up. I said sit down twice. God, I'm so unaware of myself sometimes. All right, Inano. We're cave people now. Time to make fire. Oh, oh fire. Okay. Me make fire, you get Can material. <laughs> ah, oh, oh. Mm. Uh, wait, you, you want to do what? You want to blow on it? Okay, fine, go ahead. Just don't you burn the lips. You have a big mouth like me, so come on. Blow. Yes. Dude, don't blow it out. Sorry. Sorry. Eh, you idiot. I wanted to do it like a movie. Well, this ain't a movie. It's really oh, like nice. it. It's warming up. Now, I'd really like to go camping out sometime and, and build a fire pit like that somewhere. But in Ireland, there's not really a lot of places to do it. Unless you're a big farmer and you have your own land. This looks comfy. Well, not comfy, but definitely cozy. And we've got our own little piece of heaven here, our own fried rock. Lion King reference, by the way, just in case more. you don't know. I know. Me too. Uh, I'm ready for dessert. <laughs> Go ahead. Oh, the choco crisp. Gonna share it? Do you want a piece? Hmm. I don't trust you. I know if I say yeah, you're, you're probably going to say, no, you took my other jungle crisp. So I'm just gonna say I'm good. This flavor of Versuno. Uh -huh. I'm good. You eat it. I'm the judge now, not <laughs> you. <laughs> so you can't have a piece anyway. Okay. Uh, I knew it. Figures you try to get revenge, Judge. Hey, I want a new trial. Too late. Court closed. Mm -hmm. And you little dickens, ain't so you? Oh, good. I wish we had a cheeseburger and a milkshake like yesterday. Uh, well, yesterday was yesterday. <gasps> yesterday was yesterday. Now that we're out here, we have to do everything ourselves, right? Okay. 
but you'll help me if I need it, right? That's what I'm here for. Of course, and you gotta help them. me too. Okay, so what do we have in terms of supplies? We have a lighter. We got a soda pop. Good, I took those and not the beers. Daniel needed this sugar rush. How long have we been out here? Not long enough. You okay, buddy? You need yeah. a hug? Feels good to sit down. Sean? Are you mad at me for what happened with Brett? I don't remember everything. Uh, let's comfort him. It's not his fault. In, although technically it was, but, but it wasn't. But at the end of the day, that neighbor was an asshole anyway. It's not your fault. Shit happens. Brett deserved it. Why can't I remember? Ugh, that's weird. Um... Uh, don't worry, dude. You were running around all day. You tired out. It happens. So when are we going to tell him what happened? Look! A full moon! Ooh! <laughs> it's not quite full yet, wolf boy. Do you think there are werewolves for real? Yeah, we are the wolves. We'll play along with him. Dude, we are the wolves. Don't the wolves. Oh! See? Wolves howling in the background as well. Real wolves. Careful, lads. They might come and get you. Okay, so how do I progress on from here? Just look at everything we have. Okay, we got a wallet. Almost broke. How do we eat tomorrow? How much do we even have? Thirty dollars and thirty cents. Uh, not too bad. If you use it wisely, oh, we we got our um, our weed dispenser. At this point, I definitely have a hit if I could. Well, who knows? You might come across a weed field. Funny how a little food chills Daniel out. I'm so tired. Uh, I had to get some sleep. Because well, you'll be a tired. sleepy boy. Ready to crash? I've been ready all day. My feet hurt. Okay, bro. Time to call it a night. So we're just gonna let it. I think we this earned some serious rest. I can sleep forever. Not on this ground. <sighs> oh, me? I can sleep anywhere. There, right? Way better. Yeah, I've actually slept standing up. Now we have a real In a fire. disco. And a secure story. base. You did awesome today, Daniel. Really? Hell yeah. Really, really. Yeah, you're like a a real wilderness expert. Um, that's cool. Might as well stay open or something. Yeah, good at least you won't bug me for a while. Sleep tight, bro. Oh man, that, that does look cozy. Wait, what? <laughs> Daniel, what are you doing? What are you doing? Stop doing it. Oh no, he's going to remember. Dad, where are we? Daniel? Hey, bro. Wake up! Huh? Sean? What happened? Where's Dad? It's okay. You, you just had a bad dream. Oh, he's definitely starting it's to on. remember things. Sean? Where... Where are we? Right here. 
in the park. Remember our amazing fire? Um, yeah, best yeah. keep that going. Keep the chill away. Okay. We're, we're fine. kind of okay. I'm right here. Don't worry. Okay. I won't. As long as you're here. Go. Go back to sleep. You need your rest. But I might have another scary dream. You won't. I'm here. Just. Just close your eyes. Thanks, Sean. I'm glad you're here. Good night, Daniel. That's so sweet. To see the way the fire reacted to his powers, that was kind of similar to what happened when Rachel Amber set the forest on fire back in Arcadia Bay. Remember when she screamed at the fire, just kind of took off and went out of control? So that begs the question, did Rachel Amber have uh, powers of her own or undiscovered powers? Because it almost seemed like she did. Yeah, too bad we'll never find out. I mean, there's so many ways that Look, Life is Strange Sports Storm now. was kind of underdeveloped, in my here. opinion. We just gotta keep walking. Uh, yeah, that's better. Hey, maybe we'll find a milkshake shop. Ah, oh, yes. The Four Secret Milkshake Factory. <laughs> keep never dreaming, know. dude. I've seen stranger things out in the middle of nowhere. There will be a rest stop or something where we can buy food. I'm sure of it. <sighs> Come on, stay off the road. Be a good... Oh. Remember that time Harry Thompson wanted to beat me up? Me and Noah traded some games with Harry, but he didn't like his, so he said he was gonna get us after school. And what did you do? We waited in the gym until he went home. That's it? You coward. You should have told me. I tried, but you said to get out of your room. Uh, I'll apologize. <sighs> I'm sorry, you know, no. I should have listened. You did stand up for me, with Brett, for a change. Yeah, well, he had it coming. Yeah, I kind of wish you weren't so mean all the time. I'm sorry, Daniel. Okay, hey. I just want to change the settings here for a second because the FPS has dropped slightly. Okay, there, that's a smooth 60 FPS now. And a new message from Lila. Ah, uh, that's... oh. Okay, never mind. I'm so hungry for real food right now. I hear you. We're gonna get food, water, and... plus a map. So we can find the best route. Alright. Hey, come on. I know last night was tough, but... tonight will be better. Yeah, we're gonna get some munchies. Yeah. I hope. Okay, so we have an ice container. Can we get some ice from here? Last night was so cold. I don't even want to think about ice. Boy, I could really go for a glass of ice water right now. Because I'm kind of thirsty. He says as he sips the remnants of his place. G fuel. Wildlife poster in case of black bear attacks. I'm fine. I'm too young. In case of cougar attacks, throw a 20 year old male. <laughs> okay, but drop food in possessions, do not run or play dead, fight back vigorously, aiming at the head with any object will. Hell no! No, 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 that can't be right. You freaking run like hell. You definitely don't play dead. Because, uh, you'd be open for attack. Just gotta use your head, man. Then again, I could be wrong. I could be very wrong. Okay, now what's in this newspaper? Oh, shit, they're still looking for us. Oh, shit. We can't go back. Okay, Seattle shooting ignites protest. 
Okay, so what do we have? We have lives over... I think that says over lives over BES. Uh, your daily local and global news. Fuse and culture issue number 948, October 30th, 2016. Police search for suspects Sean and Daniel Diaz. Seattle shooting at nice protest. Okay, so the people are on our side. Thank God. Daniel, no. Not right now. Okay, it won't be long before you run into trouble. Sean? You see that sign? Warning? Yeah, it's probably nothing. Either way, let's go in and buy some grub. Hello there. Whoa. Hey, Shopkey. Sean, hey, they have shocker crisps. The Halloween witch. Six down is a sharp one. Oh, choco crisp. Blue Will you move aside so I can pick one up? How the oh, hell do or you don't. That, that is so cool. Is that the voice of Seth Rogen? Definitely sound like Seth Rogen. Oh my god. Oh my god. You are the spitting image of Seth Rogen. I'll get you yeah, I'll just day. chat him up. I want to hear his voice again. I know what well, you're well, thinking. What the hell is this creep looking at? Uh, no, I don't mean... I mean... It's not as weird as it seems, though. These people, they yeah, it's even want weird. to live a normal life. Just naked. I mean, if they're not harming anyone, who's to say they're wrong? There are such things as... Uh, societal norms. I mean, but th then again, I, I suppose he, he has a point. I mean, if people want to be naked, fine. Just not on my property. Uh, okay, I'll just say nobody. Nobody? Yeah, I agree. Yes, why should we all be the same? Who says so? <laughs> Never mind. I'm getting carried away. Name's Brody. I'm Brody kind Rogan? of an online traveling journalist. Sean. Influencer. What's a online traveling Sean, journalist? fugitive. Nice to Just meet you. Just a fancy name for someone who drives around in a car, writing about people and stuff. There's Naked a few people? websites that pay me for these papers since I know how to write. Nice to meet you, man. You traveling with your brother? Yeah, you can say that. Yeah, we're on the road, going south. Good for you. The best way to learn is on the road. The earlier, the better. Oh, wise words. Well, I'd love to talk and avoid work all day, but I'm already up against the deadline. Safe travels, dudes. Thanks, man. See you around. Okay, good luck writing about naked people. After the forest. Like another world. Okay, so we've got... Wait, we can steal or we can add it to our basket. You know what? I think stealing is the last thing we need to do. And I think water over soda. It's better than tap water. So what else can we pick up? Ooh, bread. We can't make a fancy sandwich. The bread will be just fine. No, no peanut butter, no jam, no Nutella. Don't worry. We'll You're a sick freak. You a family soon. Wait. Who the hell are you talking to, you weirdo? <gasps> <gasps> of course they did. Oh Why my god, a puppy. Aww. We'll show it to Dan. Wait, no, that option's gone now. Hi, what are you looking at? Oh, hey there. Well, I'm actually doing research. It's, uh, not for you. Why? Like, dirty stuff? Yeah. <laughs> it's, uh, <laughs> adult stuff. I'm not yes, old. adult stuff. I know these kind of things. 
<laughs> yeah, I'm sure you do. What's your name? Daniel. Hey, Daniel. I'm Brody. Why are you looking at adult stuff? You know, what? I'm just or going to interrupt him. Work. Hey, hi. Uh, sorry about my brother. <laughs> oh, don't be. He's awesome. Ooh, Sean. Check it out. It's a raccoon costume. I want to be a raccoon. How much is it? Eleven dollar ninety nine, fifty dollars. Oh hell no, we don't have enough money. Okay, see you later, Mr. Raccoon. <sighs> here, come, come here, check out the puppy. No way, I can steal something this big. Man. Yeah, no shit. Look at all that food. Dude. Although, what are you saying? You managed to shove a shit ton of things in your ass pockets so not long exactly ago. What exactly are you doing all the way out here? It's a secret adventure. Is that so? Sounds intriguing. Did you make all hey, Will you shut up, her. Daniel? Sorry about that. Uh, I'm talking to her. He sure likes to chat. Yeah. He talks a lot. <sighs> Whatever. I Must do not talk too much. You always say that. But that's not true. Yeah, it is. Yes. Can I help you? You don't look like you're from around here. And? Okay, I'll just say we're camping or... Yeah, we're camping. Uh, we're camping. Yeah? Where? I... I can't remember the name. It's not far. So where are your parents? What does that matter to you? We're with... Our dad. Hmm. That makes sense. How come he's not here with you? I... Okay, waiting in the car, that'd be an obvious lie. Went hiking again, another obvious lie. So it doesn't really matter. So I'm just going to press both buttons at the same time and see which one is picked. He's um, just outside, waiting for us in the car. Okay. I didn't see your car come in. Well, didn't mean to grill you. Just making sure you're okay out here. Oh, Have thanks. a nice day. Okay, but what else we? Oh yeah, chuck. Can't go wrong with these. Hey, what about that? No, no, none of that. You use that. Uh, anything we can pick out from here? Uh, no. I... What's that? Ooh, it's a, a puppy. puppy. Go on. What's your name, Hello. huh? You're so cute. Yeah, he's a doyben. Yeah, it's a dog. Oh, a puppy! Sure. Super cute doggy. You ready? Is this yours? Somebody left her down the road. If I saw who did that, it'd be the last time. Aww. Oh, I like you. He must be sad. What's his name? Her. Whoever takes her gets to name her. Oh, right. Oh, can no, 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 no. No, not now. Sorry, we man. We can't. No way we're taking a dog with us. Oh, honey. We have to have an adult take care of her. See? Sorry about that. Now let's go. But... No, but... Okay, now let's just uh, settle Who up with you. Who postcards? Boring. Okay, I'll just pay for what I have here, and we'll be on our merry way. Looks like you're all set to go. Is that it? Yeah, I think so. Okie dokie. Let's ring you up. And there's the damage. Ooh, 1239. Yeah, I'll pay up. I think that's it. Okie dokie. Thanks much. All right, here's your change. Cool. Thanks. Don't be racially profiling us now. And let's be on our way. Hey, you bought. Okay, so what now? 
Ooh, family, and we can send Daniel to beg, or we can ask, or to speak to ourselves. Um. Hey. Hi. Uh oh, here it comes. Oh, hi there. What? You're already standoffish. Hmm. Okay, spare a little food. Yeah, I'll, I'll start off by asking asking them if they're visiting. So and then I'll ease into it. Are you guys just visiting, or <laughs> it's kind of out of the way here? Just passing through on our way to Vancouver to check on our new home, all the way from California. Yeah, like everybody else in Vancouver. Oh, that's cool there. We're from Seattle. That's nice. I just love the weather up here. Yeah, who loves the sun? Can't wait for all that snow. I hate the snow. What are you on about? Snow is awesome. I mean, everybody here loves snow. Because we very rarely get it in Ireland. In fact, we didn't even get any snow this Christmas. Or this side of spring or winter, I should say. Oh, that's not that bad. But I don't know about Vancouver. It's lovely according to the books. Oh, jeez. You and your books. We'll see. Okay, asshole. Uh, I'll just ask him if you can spare a little food, but I'm guessing... Freaking dickbag Magoo would probably say no, because he's the overbearing husband. Uh, I hate to ask, but... Uh, we forgot to get money before coming here, so... Could you spare a little food? Or something? Do you mind? We're kind of busy. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. We'd like to help. But I thought we left Berkeley to get away from this. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, hey, no worries. It's cool. Didn't mean to bug you. Bye. Come on. Let's go. Freaking asshole. Can't even check my goddamn voicemail here. There's nothing to do here. When do we leave? You leave when I say you can leave. Hey. Come on in. Let's wash a little. Ugh, I'm coming. Yeah, I'm coming. All right. Freaking princess. Okay, can we spread our butt cheeks? He looks like one of your drawings. Oh, haha, <laughs> very funny. But I can draw better than that. I know. So wash fast. Guess they cheaped out in the hot water plumbing. Okay, you're done. And we should probably fill up on water as well. Nice. Free water for us. Even though I just paid for a liter bottle. Eh, oh well. The more the better. Cocoa. Honey, this is a gas station. Daniel, will you stop harassing the nice people and come over here? <sighs> Wait, did I forget one thing? I think I did. What do I need? Find a local map, yes. I thought I was forgetting something. Oh my god, this is the coolest thing ever! Hey, come here. Check it out. Look. You've already eaten. Don't look at me like that. Well, wait. Just want to see if she has a map. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Hey, go the map. Come see. Go on. It's actually free. Cool. Thanks. Uh, thank it's you. It's a real nice map. You'll find lots of great hiking trails around here. No, oh, thank you. You're not so bad. She's you came across as a bit of a bit standoffish, but yeah, it kind of warmed up to you. Can't believe how lost we are. Thank God we found. Okay, let's get the heck out of here. Oh, okay, so that's that's different. They've taken off now. Hey, look, empty table. Uh, let's grab it. 
and check out this map. Okay, now let's see where the hell we are. Eat and study map. Good idea. It's our table now. <laughs> yep. Let's see. What do we got here? Huh. Is that all we've got? Sorry, you know. Yeah, suck it up and deal with it. Yeah. Really? You taught me a choco crisp? Of course I did. You deserved it. Oh, cutscene time. This can't be good. Or it could be. Oh, there's Brody. Where are you guys off to now? Uh, south. I guess. Right on. Pro tip, don't feed the bears. <laughs> see you later. Alright, see you later, Brody Rogan. I'll call him Brogan for short. Whoa, that's a big map. Yeah, hope I can read it. Bet you can't. Is this supposed to be Washington? I don't recognize anything. Yeah, me neither. But we have to be somewhere in there. Hey, I know. We're here. There's a gas station. See? Nah, no way. We were near Mount Rainier yesterday, but it's miles away now. Let me show you where we are, okay? Yeah, okay. Oh, we, we slept at that trout trail thing. Then we walked south for a while. So, where's the trout trail? It was here. So, we walked south, which is in this general direction. So, it must be here. All right. This is it. Are you sure? <sighs> yes, it is. It's next it, to the river we can't shit. buy yesterday. Don't question my authority. Here we are. Okay, so can we go there tonight? Are you kidding? It's way too far. You want to walk a whole week again? Ah, uh, but it looks cool. Hold on, I'll find where we can go. Wow, hey, Danny, you Looks must like have some imagination camping. for a map to look cool. Oh, oh. hey, dude. Yeah, just going over trails and stuff. Seems dangerous to be out here all alone. But maybe you're the ones who need to be watched. Huh? What, what, what are you mean? talking about? We sure just... hope you pay for all that. We don't tolerate shoplifters. Uh, sir. Hey, you did. We paid for this. And the map was free. Well, let's go inside. You can show us what you bought. Uh, I don't trust you. No, thanks. We have to go. Nope. You're going inside. Don't make this worse for yourself, kid. No. Oh, I will. Oh, he knows. He definitely knows. Either that or again, we're being racially profiled. Probably. And again, I'm getting slight... Uh, how do I say? Racial... Undertones here? Racial politics? Racial politics uh, undertones, yeah. So the best option here would be to discuss it. I mean, we're already in a lot of trouble, so we might as well be honest and prove that we bought these. Uh, excuse us, sir. We were just hiking, I swear. Then let's find out if you're telling the truth. Come on. Uh, but we have to get going. Sean? Uh, it, it's okay. Look, our our dad is waiting for us. Okay. You can call him from our phone. Now let's go. Don't I touch me. Not. Don't do it, boy. Let go. Uh, oh, you son of a bitch. <sighs> you hit a child, you son of a bitch. God, to do that absolutely zero chill. Uh, and who was he? It's Hank. Hank Stamper. Oh, Listen, he must be the of husband of the shopkeeper. Oh, they ain't going anywhere. Don't you worry. Okay, fine. Thank you. What the fuck? So he said, 
It's something about fusion, so he he knows about us. I mean, if it's in the newspaper, oh, he obviously knows. Daniel, no, no, no! Don't do this to me. At least we'll get those two slaves out. Are you sure about this, Hank? I don't know. Then they'll be off our property and won't be our problem no more. If you say so, Ben. Well, I'll let you deal with it. Oh, hey there. You finally awake? Sorry, I had to secure you. You but freaking asshole, so I didn't do anything. No, I didn't. How's your stomach? By the way, that's one thing I don't get. I don't understand how you can pass out from a, a little gut punch. Like, it seems a bit of a cliche to me. But I've never seen it happen in real life. But I suppose it can happen if you got winded enough. I'm gonna tell the police you kidnapped me. Nice try. But I know who you are and what you did in Seattle. I saw it in the paper. You don't know shit. Maybe I should call ICE to make sure you're a citizen. Fuck you, hillbilly. I'm oh. American. Mm. <sighs> Jesus. Punk. Whatever. I'm going to jail for this. Pretty sure the local police will vouch for me over a thug like you. Thug Where's like me? You're brother? the one who picked on my... Wish I knew. Little shit brother. took off. Yeah. I'll find him. Don't worry. If you touch him... You think I'd hurt a little boy? Guess you uh, didn't have any second thoughts about leading him out in the middle of nowhere, though. That's real safe for a little kid. He's lucky he won't end up like his criminal big brother. Just let me go. Please. You're the reason we need to build that wall. You hold tight. I'm gonna go get your brother. Oh... Uh... I knew it. I knew that it was going to be some sort of Trump Shit. reference or political Bastard reference or lights off. whatever reference you want Fuck. to call it. Come on, game. Really? Like, really? Like, I know back in 2016 there was huge tensions because of Trump's election. And apparently there's like a whole okay. slew of... He's okay. He's okay. Just get out of here. There's a whole oh, slew of bag. racial attacks, evidently. Like, I remember reading online that uh, apparently Mexican children were being picked on There's, by their peers. They're saying, oh, you're going to be deported. You're going to be sent back to Mexico. But I'm not sure how much of that was true. I'm guessing a portion of it might, might have been true. But I think some of it, pardon the pun, might have been trumped up. Not to say that racism doesn't exist. It does exist 100%. It's disgusting. It's abhorrent. I hate it. But I think during that time, it was kind of like what the thing to do to sort of... What if something happened to him? What would I do? Okay, uh, it was sort of like a popular thing to make up racist crimes. I mean, there was a YouTuber who did it e even... He made up the most bizarre thing about his wife and daughter saying that uh, some random dude came up to them and said, your daughter's shoes are annoying. And then he followed him back to the car and he had a Trump badge on it or, or something like that. That seemed pretty far-fetched. And also his wife and, and daughter are, um, are of Mexican heritage, so... Yeah. But I think it was kind of weird that oh, fuck. prior to all of that, there's... Why did I put us in this situation? What am I going to do? That they had uh, little to no racial tension in the area that they lived in. Because these people actually, funny enough, lived lived in Seattle. And, and the go-to thing was, oh, well, Trump made racism okay. Uh, I don't think that's the, the case. It's just that... Everybody was more focused on, on it. It was sort of brought to light. Thank, thank God, which is which is a good thing. I mean, like, like racism is just nasty. It's 
I've, I've already said it. I, I don't agree with it. I don't Come condone on. it. I hate it. It's only plastic. Come Fuck. on, use your strength, this man. Shit. Wiggle small bit. Yeah, I. Please don't let anything happen to Daniel out there. Yeah, he'll be fine. He's a he's a lone wolf, like you. Can I open this door? I don't think I can. No, not a hope in hell. Yeah, that's what I thought. Fuck. Okay, what about the computer? Wonder if I could get more light from it. We can push this. Just give it a little bit of a nod. There you go. <gasps> yes. That's a little better. Oh, now you can see the sign. I saw the sign and it opened up my mind. I saw the sign. Uh, let's take a look at this family portrait here. Yeah, we get it. You're the perfect Americans. Yeah, no. That shop owner, Sean. douche. <gasps> oh, is that you, Nino? Daniel? I'm right here. Are, are you okay? I, I, I think so. That old guy chased me into the woods. But I, I think I lost him. Is he gone? I'm really, really scared. <laughs> hey, Emmanuel. You're doing great. You totally fooled them. <sighs> nice. Next to you, we have a chance of getting out of here. Yeah? Yeah. We gotta hurry, though. He called the cops on us. Think, dude. There's gotta be a way out of here. Kicking this shell should help, maybe? Oh, nice. We knocked down a little wooden bear. How's that gonna help, though? Hanks. I'm sorry. Boris? But you married an asshole. Yeah, that's right. Can you try and open this vent? Yes. Ouch. It hurts. I don't care. Sorry, Sean. I don't know. Don't worry. We'll figure something out. I don't know what you planned on doing by opening up the vent. Like, what could that do? Oh, yeah, you could probably squeeze in and help me escape. Yeah, that, that makes sense. Or open the window. Hey. You think you can open the back door? I don't know. Yeah, it's gonna be locked, I bet. Yeah, of course. But it won't open. It's locked. What do I do? Try the I window. Don't know. Let me think. There's a window over there. Maybe you can find a way in or something. Yeah, just uh, chuck a rock through it. It should be grand. Maybe this place is so old it doesn't have an alarm. I mean, look at the type of computer he's using. He's using an old CRT computer. I haven't seen one of those since the late 2000s. It is. Early 2000s, sorry. Be careful. It might attract him. Open. Oh, we got keys of course we'll somehow get to those maybe the over there. oh I see we're gonna we're gonna try and shimmy over come on try and turn them again go on right I need something to break this shit maybe Daniel can help maybe maybe not okay Daniel I doubt it I don't I have much faith keys. in him but I can't reach them. <sighs> Maybe I can get them if I can pry this pipe off the wall. Can you find some kind of tool out there? I don't know where one is. Find me something sturdy, like a, a screwdriver or a wrench, anything. But where can I find one? Just look around, you idiot. And I know I can't really see much from where I am. There should be some tools nearby. Okay, okay, I'm looking. 
Now we just play the waiting game. I hear something. Sean, uh, I found something. Come on, Sean. We gotta hurry. Before Ooh, I'll take it. Is this what you wanted? This is it. You rule, Daniel. Okay, so now I can break these off. Come on. Let's do this. Come on, let's go. These are super human strength. Yes. Nice. Good job, bro. Forward with L. Okay, come on. Squeeze your fat ass through that. Okay, there we go. Now we can just reach the keys. Come, come on, on, you mother. You yes. sports. Or your foot, Sport. that'll do. But how am I supposed to pick them up? Oh, I get it. Can't you do it? Here, here. Come on. Okay, hold on. Okay, wait for it, wait for it. Yes! Sean! Hey, bro, long time no oh, see! Oh, God. I was so scared. What happened to your face? That old bastard happened. Okay. We need to cut this off fast. Yeah, make yourself useful and find me a pair of scissors or Oh And they do words right out of my mouth. Or at least the actions. No way. I'm invisible. Yeah, you are. Okay. Now we gotta get my stuff. Uh oh. Oh, what did he do? What, what happened? What what did you do? He used a force. Where play? I don't know. I don't know what happened. It's okay. You're safe now. Okay, we could steal camping gear or leave. Again, we're in way over our heads here, so I think. There might be CCTV footage or a CCTV camera here and and if they see that footage of us stealing that'll put us or paint us in a more negative light. So yeah, let's just make like a tree Move and it. get out of let's here. Go. Now. Come on. Come on. Wait. Although I hope we didn't kill him. I just hope he's knocked out. Shit. Far away from there. Sean, watch out! Over there. L let's go. I don't know. Into a stranger's car. Oh, it's it's broken. Oh, oh, what are you doing out here, man? You almost scared the shit out of me. You guys okay? Hello. You okay. That asshole at the gas station. We're fucking crazy. Tight me up in his back office. I swear. Dude, say no more. I believe you. Okay. She's crazy out in the woods. Get in, you too. Oh, Hurry thank up. God! Oh, funny, sane human. Oh, Brogan, I love you. I know his name is Brody, but he sounds like Seth Rogen. Although I don't think it's Seth Rogen that voices him. Nah, I I'm almost sure it's not. But he has a body and voice of Seth Rogen. I gotta look this up at some point. Damn, that is 
crazy. And I thought I was having a shitty day. I knew that guy was sketchy. Okay, uh, I would just say he was a total fucking dickhead, which he was. Fucking dickhead. I'm lucky I didn't beat his ass. Whoa, kid. Maybe he deserved it, but don't do it and don't talk about it. Nah, you know that's right. Sorry. I'm just still pissed off. Welcome to Redneck Land. I ain't Seattle no more. Eh. <laughs> Did I use your dog? Are you not going to address that? Yeah. My dad said there are more Bigfoots out here than Mexicans. No doubt. People out here are more scared of you and your little brother. This is nuts. Well, don't let it phase you, little dude. You're going to meet some amazing people on the road, too. <coughs> What's under the blanket? Come on, I'm not stupid. You stole the puppy, didn't you? <sighs> you idiot. Daniel. What? We <laughs> saved her. We're heroes. Uh, not really. You essentially stole her from the shop owner. Are you kidding me? We can't keep a dog. But uh, we couldn't leave her with those mean people. <laughs> Don't give up, Daniel. He's on the ropes. Jeez, come on. We <laughs> need a dog. Bet Dad would agree. Just, just stop. You win, but you better really take care of her. Deal. Thanks, Sean. Well, we have to keep her now. So quiet. And 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 what should we name her? Hey, you know, cookie your or something. Your choice. Oh, cool. Let's see. Um, cookie. Um, Cookie's about, brown. Um, mushroom. She totally looks like a mushroom. Oh no, no, that's not even a name. Come no. on. That's not even a name, dude. But I love mushrooms. And you said it was my choice. Okay, yeah, your choice okay. within reason. You win. <laughs> but this one's on you. Ooh, yeah. Thanks, big brother. See, mushroom, you got the best name ever now. <laughs> I disagree. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I feel like I just witnessed history. You're on your way to becoming official road warriors, my dudes. Dude, we're already road fugitives. I mean, he probably knows that. I mean, he, he's gotta know it. I mean, if it's in the newspaper. Sounds like you've been on the road for a long time. Long, boring story short. I come from a family with money. But no soul. I took off after school and never looked back. Now I write stories for zines and websites, do podcasts, protest, try to make some positive change. Well, whatever. Wow. So you're uh, like all political. You're one of those people. Everything is political, Sean. Oh. Yeah, I'll just ask him if he ever gets lonely. I mean, Jesus, everything is political. That's something I kept seeing, at least on Twitter, way back in 2016. Oh, everything's political. Star Wars is political. Uh, Toy Story is political. Everything is political. I mean, people didn't really care about politics that much, at least the people that ran in my circle or that I knew of. We went from became president. Everything had to be about politics. Games had to be about politics. Uh, movies, TV shows, all that. They all had to be political, apparently. I mean, people were even making references to Star Wars being political, even though it's a science fiction film. Sure, there were elements of 
uh, politics in it, but he had no bearing on the real world. I mean, yeah, sure, it had a few contrasting points or uh, relevant points, or not even relevant points, but points of reference to real world politics, I suppose. But it had no bearing. As far as I'm concerned, 2016 was a shit year and everybody was calling each other Nazis and fascists and all sorts of nasty names just because they weren't on the same side of the political spectrum. Ugh. God. Humanity worries me sometimes. Okay, but either way, let's progress on. We'll ask him if he ever gets lonely. Yeah. That sounds cool. Don't you ever get kind of lonely? Uh, there's a big difference between alone and lonely. Yeah. And you probably meet a lot of people out here. That's right. The unseen side of America. Hmm. Hey, no matter what, I just try not to get cynical. Otherwise, uh... I'd be like my family. End of the day, we have to watch out for each other, right? Yeah. Right. You did watch out for us. Thank you. Seriously. Squad for life. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like your brother crashed hard. Oh. Aww. Good. He always goes right to sleep in cars. Yeah. And feel free to do the same. I won't take it personally. What about you? You okay to drive? Oh, yeah. This is my favorite time to drive. Traveling by night is kind of mysterious. Definitely. As I was on a bit of a road trip myself there not long ago, and I came back during the middle of the night, slash early morning, and nighttime driving just hits differently. It's more peaceful. Oh, I know, this is just going to be a copyright strike. I, mean, I think I have it down low enough, though, that it might pass. Oh, but I just don't like the political leaning so far. I'm not going to shit on the game and say, Oh, God, it's horrible because it has political references. Uh, no, that has no bearing on whether the game is good or not, but it just... It's very on the nose. Okay, so on North Oregon coast, three hours later. Hold on. Wasn't Arcadia Bay in Oregon? I'm not sure. I I forget. I I I I don't I don't I don't, I don't think so. I'm I'm not sure. Where where was base? Wait, you taking leak, bro? Bro, homeo? Broken? Oh, it was Sean. Man, look at that. Look at that view. Oregon is like the edge of the world. Hmm. Wait, is that Arcadia Bay? Because Arcadia Bay had a lighthouse. That's a lighthouse out in the distance. Hey. No, it can't be. I know what happened with you guys in Seattle. Uh oh. Do you want to talk about it? I'm a good listener. It's your call. No pressure. I. I don't Wanted even know what happened. Let it out. It was so fast. I would say it was the popo. It was the police. It's their fault. Dano just wanted to play zombie outside. Our shithead neighbor was picking on him. I got in a fight. So dad came out to help. Somebody called the cops and, and they shot him. They killed my dad in front of me. One second my dad was alive. Then... <laughs> Fucking cops. Hey, it's gonna be alright. 
take a deep breath. That's one thing I would say about America. The police are the scariest thing. They are way too trigger happy. I mean, here in Ireland, we don't have Listen, guards with guns. We have I'm an armed really response unit, but we but, you, man. but like foot patrol guards, they're unarmed. Bird or batons is everywhere, and you're taking the brunt of it right now. But you're gonna be okay, Sean. Yeah, I don't know. How? Wish I could go back to my town. Even if it was boring like that one. At least I've had friends. Family. A home. I used to bitch about it so much. Now I've got... Nothing. What is sure is... That's the past. But you can't look back now. You've got each other. And you have to move forward. Why? You may not see it, but what you and your brother have is the most important thing. He needs you. And you need him. I can tell he doesn't know what happened. Sean. At some point, you're going to have to tell him. <sighs> no, I, I'll say I know. I know. I just have to find the right time. Take it from me. The sooner you can address it, the better. Yeah. Yeah, it's like I'm a band-aid. Just got to rip just... it off. It's not going to be easy. So then, what's your plan? Where are you going? Good question. I was thinking... Get out of the country? Fuck it. Go down to Mexico, you know? <laughs> Damn. I thought I was the long-haul traveler. Ugh. <sighs> Should we go back? That is a very good question. Should I go back? But then again, it's up to, to him. Seattle? Maybe I can try and explain everything. What happened? You should do what you think is best. If going to Mexico seems like the right thing to do, then so be it. You're going in the right direction. You have family there? Maybe. We don't even have family in the U.S. Except for grandparents, we don't see anymore. Aww. What about your mom? No, no way. She's out of the picture. But dad, he always talked about this plot of land he owns in this little coast town, Puerto Lobos. That's a pretty cool name. So it's got to be great. Puerto Lobos. Okay, so you've still got a long ways to go. We've shot the shit long enough. Time to hit the road. Okay, yeah. Good idea, Brogan. Welcome to Arcadia Bay. Oh! That that was Arcadia Listen, Bay. I'll drop you by a motel in a couple of hours. You guys could use some time to yourselves. Because okay, I'm not sure if I said this in the first part, but when I started up the game, it asked me if I destroyed Arcadia Bay or saved Arcadia Bay I selected I saved Arcadia Bay so I'm wondering if that has any bearing on that decision at the start of the game it probably does so what I might do I might go back and replay this part at some point uh, on a new save and say I did destroy Arcadia Bay it might have an, have an effect or might not but I'm thinking it, it, it will Arc Arcadia Bay won't be won't be there and I'm guessing it might be probably yeah, another placard saying <laughs> something else. But yeah, that was that was cool seeing it, even though it was small. But okay, it's nice to have that reference. Uh, no. Come, 
See if you can catch me. Ow! <laughs> Ooh, nice spin. All right. I've been recording for about an hour and 20 minutes, so I think that's going to be a wrap for me. I'll just pause the game. Uh, there we go. Yeah, so far, so good. I mean, the only part I don't like, again, it, it's nothing personal against the game or developers, but the whole political leaning, the whole political stance, it sort of paints them as these... Or paints, uh, what's his name, Sean and Daniel as as victims of society because of their skin color and i think that has just a very broad brush to paint everyone yes racism exists everyone has acknowledged that it's it's disgusting is it's abhorrent and here's the sad thing like racism no matter how much you say it's bad no matter how many people know it's bad it's still going to exist it's not going to fade out completely it'll still be there like you'll get better over time less people will learn to be or sorry more people will learn to be tolerant of other people other cultures religions backgrounds but you will always have that small vocal minority of people who will think oh this person is lesser because of his religion because of his upbringing because of his background because of his skin color whatnot those people are pieces of shit that don't deserve to breed my ear that's what what i leave it out on or that's what i leave the, the note on <laughs> uh i don't know what to say but um yeah so far the game pretty well pretty solid so far i'm not sure where it where it's going like i hope to god it's not going to be all this sort of political bashing and sort of trump bashing well you can bash trump all you want he's no longer in office i i don't care i had no beef or no part in american politics i mean people can comment on it or whatnot but i didn't really care about it whatsoever uh yeah all right but just leave it off i'm very excited to see where this goes i hope there's more references to arcadia bay to the first game i hope we get to meet people from arcadia bay i hope maybe we might even see chloe or max or it might be references to them somewhere along the line maybe and i wonder how my decision of saving arcadia bay will impact the story that's actually a very good mechanic to have it's a very good um uh plot point or, or hook because i thought it was going to be completely irrelevant but uh yeah fair play square enix i love the f that fact that there are going to be references to life is strange one because life is strange was such a good game such a good narrative uh well-built characters well structured and again nice uh, how to say backdrop set pieces everything that that game was a masterpiece but as for before the storm uh not really it was a bit of a letdown i think i've already said that anyway guys i'll leave it there you know what to do if you did like this video by some miracle be sure to give it a massive thumbs up comment favorite share and of course like always i'll see you guys in the next one so until next time see ya